Last night, my family decided to wake up at 8, which is already really early. And apparently, everyone's bodies naturally woke up even earlier. So my dad came to wake me up at 7.30 and said that everyone was already downstairs. So I'm gonna go join them. And I'm wearing this new pajama that I got last night because my mom got my entire family matching ones. I love Christmas. Best time of the year. This is this. Let me explain. You opened it at the same time as kind of thing. Hogwarts playing cards. Very rude. <gasps> I've seen this. Like it's really carve your face. Oh. I've seen this. I wanted it. Oh. Pure milk I, chocolate pieces. No, just... I knew I was getting this. Thank you. I'm excited to break. I said I want to get this for myself and you told me not to. Were you planning Did to I say it? not to? I don't yeah. remember. Is it from Aveda? Or did you wrap it in different? Oh, I just had a bunch of boxes. Oh. <gasps> Yay! Yay! I really wanted this. Thank you, mommy. It's so cute. Yay! Oh my god. What? It's the invisibility cloak. <laughs> Does it actually work? It's yeah. That's really cool. Thank you. That's the company. Thank you. Little women. Look at how beautiful of a version it is. I chose this version. You did? Yeah, I asked for this version. I wrote like in brackets like puffin oh, I, version. I, I, I didn't even notice that. I just, oh, you just I, chose it. When I saw Little Women, I said I have to find a beautiful version. So we have the same version that we like. It would have been funny if you thought that a different version was prettier and you didn't get the version I had asked for. <laughs> hoodie that I picked out. Aww. I don't think I have a white hoodie. Love Thank it. you. <laughs> Slippers. Yay. They're so soft. Yay. It's my other books. Big Summer and Park Avenue Summer. Woohoo. Thank you. I have to talk kind of quietly right now because I don't want anyone in my family to hear me. But it is Christmas Eve right now and I'm about to go and put the gifts that I got for my family under the Christmas tree. And I am going to be filming tomorrow morning, but no one in my family likes to be on camera. So I'm not going to be able to film their reaction to opening these gifts. But I really wanted to show you guys what I got for my family because this year was our first year doing gag gifts. So every single person got three gifts. They had to be between $20 to $30 and they're supposed to be funny kind of joke gifts and I'm so proud of the gifts that I found. The first gift that I got my mom is kind of like to tease her because this past summer was her 50th birthday and I know that like ages are very taboo among older women and also she doesn't really count this past summer as her 50th birthday because we weren't really able to celebrate it because of COVID. So she still says that she's 49 and whenever we are able to like take a trip or do something for her birthday then she will actually turn 50. So I kind of wanted to tease her and get her some 50 birthday decorations. So then I just have the rest of the party decorations. They're just like little circles that say 50th birthday. There's like a bunch of them in this little plastic thing. And then a funny thing that my mom does is that she's never actually tried to learn Spanish. Like it's not that she's bad at Spanish. She just knows a few words because they're common like hola. For her entire life up until like two years ago, she thought that hola was hola, pronouncing the H. I got her this Spanish book. It's a baby book for babies learning Spanish and it has the first 100 words that a baby should learn and it's a little fancy because it's like a lift the flap book so she can play around with it this must be from zoe hey! <laughs> that's because it's so complicated <laughs> cheers okay cheers. to 50 years i guess and lift the flap prim so this is zoe <laughs> 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 sure. My dad hates cats more than anything in the world. Like he literally despises cats and I'm so sorry for all the cat lovers out there. I got him this pair of socks that say cat dad on the bottom and then have pictures of cats and like a cat paw. So I thought this was really funny cause he's gonna hate it. Like he hates cats. And then also my dad hates candy. Like he likes chocolate, but he hates candy. He always has, like even as a kid, he hated Halloween because he just doesn't like candy. So I got him a pack of 50 Jolly Rancher Logs 
lollipops. These are all the lollipops and it smells so strongly of like sugar. Oh my god. What do the socks say? Go for it. You want socks? <laughs> no. What? Are you throwing your present away? You guys are crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna say Jolly Ranchers from Zoe. Mm -hmm. There were so many directions I could have gone for Ryan's gift, but I found this gift box already pre-prepared. So he loves bacon and I got him this bacon gift box. It smells so strongly of bacon and I hate bacon. So honestly, it smells disgusting, but who is that? The first thing in the box are bacon socks. So one of the socks has just like bacon on it. And then this one says, bring me some bacon. Bacon flavored floss, bacon flavored mints, bacon flavored lip balm, and a bacon scented air freshener, even though he doesn't have a car. It says bacon lovers gift box. Does it smell like bacon? The box in general smells like bacon. That is so awesome. cool. Yeah. And this is from you. Yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> rendering equals bedtime. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yay, this is actually fun. Random Harry Potter facts you probably didn't know. Oh. Let's see if I know them. I knew this, I knew number five, and I knew number nine. Oh, and I knew number six, and I knew number eight. But magic eight ball? How is that a gag gift? Because like you have difficulty making decisions. Oh, <laughs> that's true. So, what should I ask? Um. She needs another magic eight ball to figure out what yeah. <laughs> So that was my Christmas morning vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching. Christmas morning is my literal favorite part of the year and we haven't had a proper Christmas morning in the last two years because we went to Universal Orlando the last two years for Christmas. So this was super fun. I'm so happy that I got to experience another festive Christmas morning with my family. We're gonna do two Zooms with my family this afternoon. One at one in the afternoon with my dad's family and then at five with my mom's family. So I have that to look forward too, and I have more gifts over there from my cousins and my grandparents to open. I hope that if you guys were celebrating Christmas Day, you had an amazing Christmas as well. And if you don't celebrate Christmas, I wish you happy holidays and happy new years. And I'll see you guys in my next video.